Hey guys, welcome back to the Unturned Adventure series. I... There's a guy out here somewhere. Right as I was, I was about to grab this... Ural or whatever it was. I logged out and then logged back in like maybe 10 minutes later. And it's gone. Someone's here. And I saw a guy running. I don't know where, where, where he is though. So I'm currently out. In the middle of the woods. Way out here. And there's a base down here. But it looks as though it's either abandoned. Or it's currently being built. I think it was abandoned though maybe. So guys this is the Unturned Adventure series. A series where I uh, have been doing things on my own. And exploring the, the countryside and kidding people who get in my way all right so let's look here I'm currently all the way up here beast Charlie's this way there's a uh, feast at it's a feast at uh, raise rise right now and I don't think I need to go there because I have ammo for everything what the crap is this look at this freaking thing in the sky dude no way if this is like someone's actual base this is insanely impressive you know how long it would have it must have taken to make this it's a base up there too yo this is seriously somebody built that thing up there all right we're gonna stick uh to the woods i don't want to be seen crossing out in the open I've got a pretty good uh, I'm pretty geared out I've got my uh, heartbreaker a viper tons of ammo eggs all kinds of stuff <laughs> eggs I include eggs in my list of amazing things I've got a heartbreaker and a viper and I got some eggs <laughs> what's wrong with me uh, there's a, another base right here this is where people build bases at out, out here as if you can even keep anything for that long anyway Knock, knock. Honey, I'm home. It's nothing. Nothing up here. We're going to go check this base, though. This one looks fairly hidden. Have a good gear. We can share. I've got a gear, too, man. I'm not teaming with anybody. We're looking for some... We're looking for a firefight. That's what we're looking for. But I'm also looking for... A base to raid. I've been looking for a good base for the past, I don't know how long. All right. Oh, here we go. Just double check real fast. Make sure nobody's coming. Oh, we got an axe, baseball bat, and a saw. I'm gonna take this duct tape. Okay, nothing. We got some duct tape though, because that is insanely, insanely valuable. Here's another. Are you kidding me? Come on. Come on, man. Wait, who's saying what about me? Is that guy back on the server? Who's saying what? Oh, he's saying I don't spawn things in. I was going to say, I'm like, what? I don't spawn things in. I kill people for my gear. This is what happens, okay? So let's say I get killed in one episode. In the next episode, I pretty much only do one thing. And that's, well, actually, not in the episode. I don't usually show it. But I find someone, I kill them, I take their loot. And then uh, we usually pick it back up with the adventure. I should actually start recording those. The only problem is, the reason why I don't, is that usually that takes me like an hour or so to get gear again and so I don't usually like to show just some like random exploration of getting loot and finding somebody and killing them because it can take a long time and there's really no telling how long it takes either okay we're gonna go check out this giant thing in the sky here I do have NVGs okay just gotta make sure nobody's around somebody could always be building this right now you know oh here's another big base See, these bases look 
Like, they're big enough to where this could be somebody... So it's somebody's actual base that they're still, like, building. Only one way to find out, though. Doors open. Oh, it's completely open. It's been raided. Oh, yeah. It's been heavily raided. We got missing floors and stuff. Ah, oh, gosh. I feel like there's somebody in there. No, it's just a dis discoloration of the tree. Okay, let's uh, let's go check out this thing. Who the heck made this? You know how long it would take to make this thing up here? It's a great sniper area, though. Because not only would you have to, like... It's another base. Completely open. Not only would you have to build... Oh, wow. Good thing I jumped... See the spikes? Well, if we fall, we're not going to die. Dude, what the heck? This is crazy. Is there is there a height limit? There's got to be a height limit. Holy smokes, this is insane. So tall. It's so high up. I think this is the highest I've been in Unturned. Right here. I don't think I've ever built this high. And on these on this map, you know, since it's a custom map. What if there's somebody up here? What if there's just like two people up here? Oh man. You guys, wish me luck. I knew it! I knew it! I freaking knew it! Uh, that always you guys, that stuff always happens. I go to jump and I missed it. Uh, I feel like there's nothing up there. I'm not going to run all the way back up there. I'm just falling for ages over here. How much damage are we going to take? Oh, I only took, I only took 6% damage from that fall. Ah, uh, man. Like, I always do that. Biggest fail ever. Gosh dang it. Uh, I don't know how many times I've been in situations like that in games where I've, uh... Where I've fallen, I've had like a perfect setup, and then I fall. Well, we're exploring the countryside in these last two episodes. Not a whole lot happened, but I've had some pretty good conversation with you guys about different things. I must find Entek. He right here. Oh, gosh. Please don't say somebody found me. I don't want to be found! I'm exploring, looking for bases to raid. Alright, here we go. I could have, like, suffered some serious injuries by, uh, stepping on those spikes, though. You don't see sp that many spikes anymore. We used, to, we used to litter places with spikes. Just spikes everywhere. Just to do it. Just to be jerks. Nothing. All of these all of these bases have been a bust. Okay, let's see. Where are we going to go? Let's go to base Charlie. We'll head up that way. I know these last two episodes haven't been, like, you know, full of action and stuff, but hopefully you guys still enjoy it regardless. And hopefully you guys uh, liked what I talked about. Gosh, man, that's so upsetting about that thing. Uh, I should have freaking made that jump. Every time I play a game, and there's a jump like that, that kind of thing happens, and I miss it, and I fail. That's why, like, some of those games, like, I don't even play. Like, you know those games where you have, like, one life or something, or, you know, it relies on your skill and, like, how you do things like that? Because I always mess up, and I always fail, and there's really no, uh, point to me playing those games, because I, I can't even do it. I just fail hardcore. Man. This has been a bust looking for stuff. I kind of like doing this adventure series though where I'm like it's like a let's play. I'm going back to back because it you know I got a story going on here. And also it's like well how long can I actually s stay alive for? That's kind of the thing that I do is like how long can I survive for? Cuz if I if I can go like a like a whole day or more, I consider that good. 
But I gotta get in the firefight, so you gotta get into a good firefight. You can't just... You can't just take it easy and play it super safe all the time. There's no fun in that, sneaking around. You gotta get in your... You gotta get in firefights. Well, okay, here we go. We got something down here. Sleeping bag. I have a sleeping bag somewhere. Maybe this is my sleeping bag. You know what? This is my sleeping bag. I'm surprised this is still here. This is crazy. I'm really surprised. Yeah, it's mine. Wow, that's been there for so freaking long. It's been there for like a couple weeks now. Or however long we've been on this server, I think. A long time. I'm surprised no one has found that. I, I got a good spot. But yeah, I'm trying to find bases to raid. Because one, I haven't broken into a base in like forever. And two, that's where the fun is. Okay, we got the base down here. Base, base Charlie. Got some barbed wire down there. Barbed wire everywhere, actually. Also, we have the Feast at Van Clave coming up. We could always go back there because it's not too far away. I don't think there's anybody down there. Oh, I want to shoot somebody with my show field as well. Haven't haven't shot anybody with that thing in so long. Would enjoy to do that. We got Van Clave in five minutes. We can go down here and raid this base. Every time I go to the military base, though, it's just a bust. It's just a waste of time. The feast is where it's at because that's where you run into people. Okay, let's see here. Let's go back to Van Clave and uh, hit up that feast, maybe. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I know there wasn't a lot of things in this episode, but... That was kind of a cool find, finding that big statue thing in the sky. Hope you guys enjoyed the video nonetheless. And like I said, you know, uh, feel free to talk in the comments with me about some of the things that I talked about because, you know, I'd love to hear how you guys play the game. Like, what, what are your methods? Do you sneak around a lot? Do you just go full force and just attack everybody? Do you roll in a groove? How do you play unturned? I'd be interested in hearing that and finding out what you guys do so thank you so much for watching guys thanks for uh always checking out the videos hit that thumbs up button if you did like the video and subscribe if you're new to the channel and i'll see you guys next time